presents... From Fantasyland, Wind in the Willows. This portion is brought to you by Hills Brothers Coffee and Instant Hills Brothers Coffee. Richer and stronger in coffee flavor and coffee aroma. Coffee, coffee. Richer, stronger, I'll last longer. Follow me, men. Head for the hill. It's good, strong coffee. It's Hills Brothers. Coffee, coffee. Richer, stronger, I'll last longer. This way, lady. Head for the hill. A pound really does go a long way. It's Hills Brothers. Coffee, coffee. Richer, stronger, I'll last longer. Come on, everybody. Head for the hill. Everybody seems to. It's great coffee. Coffee, coffee. Richer, stronger, I'll last longer. OK, coffee lovers, head for the hill. Head for the hill, brothers, coffee. <laughs> Here in the Library of Classics at the Disney Studios in California is Walt Disney. Some years ago in England lived a very gifted storyteller by the name of Kenneth Graham. Like his contemporary Lewis Carroll who wrote Alice in Wonderland, Kenneth Graham was not a professional writer. And like Carroll who taught mathematics at Oxford University, Kenneth Graham held a responsible position in the world of figures. He was the official acting secretary of the mighty Bank of England. And again, like Carroll, he sought escape from this rigid workaday life in a world of imagination and fable. Unfortunately for posterity, Graham was a shy, modest kind of man. Because when the success of his story showed every indication of turning Graham into a popular celebrity, he promptly stopped writing it. Now this week, we want to pay tribute to Mr. Graham with two of his stories. The first, The Reluctant Dragon. Once upon a time, long, long ago, in a faraway land across the sea, there lived a little boy who considered himself quite an authority on brave, fearless knights and their mortal enemies, those horrible, fire-breathing dragons that daily terrorized the countryside. One afternoon, as the boy sat deeply engrossed in his favorite subject, May is National Awning Month, and right now your dealer is featuring the year's best values in aluminum awnings. Awnings made of rust-free Reynolds aluminum. You can choose from a wide range of handsome designs and configurations, styles and color combinations to match the architecture of practically any home. And they all feature baked enamel finishes that stay bright and attractive. You know, these are the finest awnings you can buy because only aluminum is so effective in bouncing back the sun's hot rays to help keep your home as much as 15 degrees cooler and to cut air conditioning costs way down. And because they're aluminum, they'll never rot, never tear, will not rust ever. So order your awnings now, and be sure they're aluminum. Reynolds aluminum, as featured in the famous House of Ease homes. This emblem means quality. Look for it when you buy. The second of the Kenneth Graham stories on our program this week is, we believe, a true classic. It belongs in our library on the shelf with other great classic tales of English literature. It's called The Wind in the Willow and concerns the adventures of a certain character known as Mr. Toad. Here is Basil Rathbone to tell the story. J. Thaddeus Toad. Wonder who owns a cat here? Uh, correction, two cats. Why, it's the home of Edgar Bergen. If it wasn't for me, Bergen wouldn't own a home. 
and Charlie McCarthy. We have two cats at our home. You're always crowding the act, Bergen. And a large family of kittens. <laughs> yeah. Cats make wonderful family pets and companions. <laughs> Playful little rascals. Yes, they are, Charlie. But to enjoy them fully, they must be in good health. To keep your cat in the pink of condition, feed the balanced diet of Puss in Boots cat food. Puss in Boots is made from fresh caught whole fish. Your cat gets the high quality proteins in the fish fillets, vitamins and minerals for buoyant health, the calcium your pets need for sound bones and teeth. And for all round nutrition, tasty cereals are added, plus extra vitamin B1, the nerve vitamin. So if you want a beautiful cat with bright, playful spirits like Edgar Bergen's pets, start feeding Puss in Boots regularly. Puss in Boots is good nutrition. Here's how to get three times as much Reynolds Wrap for less than three times the price. Hello, this is Rex Marshall speaking for Reynolds Aluminum. And this is the big value in aluminum foil, the 75-foot economy roll of Reynolds Wrap. It's the same pure aluminum foil as the Reynolds Wrap you get in the regular roll, same width, same precision smoothness, same toughness. But when you buy the 75-foot economy roll, you get as much Reynolds Wrap as you get in three rolls of regular Reynolds Wrap. And yet, you pay less than three times the price. Your savings? Why, it's just like getting 12 extra feet of Reynolds Wrap for free. And that's enough to wrap a lot of sandwiches, roast a lot of chickens, line a lot of casseroles to save on dishwashing. So use Reynolds Wrap to save yourself time and trouble and get the economy roll to save yourself money. Reynolds Wrap. The aluminum foil that outsells all others combined. This portion was brought to you by the Quaker Oats Company, makers of fine foods for the whole family. This week, enjoy one of the many fine products of the Quaker Oats Company. Here comes that shaggy dog again in Walt Disney's new motion picture. Get him! That, that shaggy dog just stole my car! Follow that dog. It's the funniest adventure that ever happened to anyone. See Fred McMurray and Gene Hagen in Walt Disney's new motion picture, The Shaggy Dog. It will play in a theater near you. This has been an ABC Television Network film presentation.